hey you guys it's time for their hair video girl i just saw the camera <laughs> rat tail comb so it is time to put my hair and my go-to protective style now those of you who have been following me for a while you know that i like to wear my hair in twists it doesn't matter what type of twists they are it could be twists on wet hair it could be twists on blown out hair um it could be just any type of twist loose twists which almost resemble dreadlocks after a while um or just regular two strand twists so my hair has been in this blown out state for about a week i've uh, gotten some shrinkage um of course i don't have my one big comb around me y'all uh it's okay i need to go find me a comb y'all just a second all right, you guys, I have my big Hercules comb. Now, as you can see, I'm getting strands of gray hair. It's almost silver. You see that? <laughs> Ciao. It is what it is. I'm getting them throughout my hair. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and comb my hair out. It's a little tangled. And like I said, it's, 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 shrunken up because honestly it's supposed to be down it i'm not going to do anything to yeah i could go in the back and put a blow dryer to it but what for there's really no need the twists are still going to be fairly long so all right y'all i have all my hair clips one two three four five six i feel like i'm missing some so i have all my beads here and what I'm going to do is I'm going to be using wooden beads, which are these. I'm going to be using these wooden beads, okay? As far as products go, I'm going to be using just a little bit of the Hollywood Beauty Olive Oil Shine Moisturizer. And then to set my hair, I'm going to be using the TGIM Buttercream Moisturizer. This is technically a leave-in conditioner, but I like to use it as a styler. But to completely seal it in, or meaning to keep some hold onto my twist, I'm going to be using the Echo Styler Gel. Sorry, y'all. And then to seal in the moisture, I have my Amla Hair Oil, which is in this dispenser, okay? All right, y'all. This is a put the beats on. Now, y'all, I get really serious. Like, I ain't got time. Since it's, since it's a lot of hair, it probably would take me between two to three hours to set my hair and twist. But then I like to go ahead and pick out my beads. And I like to make sure that the bead, beads, excuse me, are, let me show you an example. It needs to be clear. It needs to be a hole all the way through. Now, if... There's some problems. I have a little mini drill. Yeah, I get that. I get that way. I have a little mini drill um, that I can use, but I like to inspect the beads because I don't want my hair to get snagged onto the actual bead itself. So you guys, let me go ahead and I like to do, I mean, there's different ways you can set your hair. Personally, me, I like to go ahead and section off my hair and the style that I plan on setting my twist. Girl, this is a style in itself. Yes, come through, blow out. So, <laughs> um, I like a deep part. I always like a deep part, but you can definitely do it straight in the middle. I don't like to wear my hair like this. I really don't, y'all. I don't know what it is, but I'm so used to this deep part. So, I'm going to go ahead. First of all, I'm going to try to do a, I'm going to try to find the part. All right, I have to go into the bathroom to section it off. Now, some people like to get very very um precise with their parts i just feel like i have so much hair even with all the twists in it doesn't matter so i'm gonna finger part my hair and then put my hair in um large twists <laughs>
right, that's it. We done. No. <laughs> Child. All right, y'all. Let me get all this stuff out of the way. Okay. So, the first thing is I'm going to add the moisturizer. We're going to need just a little bit of moisturizer, okay? Like a quarter. Is that a quarter? Now, I just said I wasn't going to part my hair, didn't I? Didn't I just say that? And look at me. Well, you're going to be in the front. You're going to see the front. So, I think that's good enough, y'all. So, since this, this is going to take me a couple of hours, I'm not going to. There's no way I'm going to do this on cam. But I will come back. Because you guys have seen me set my hair and twist. I will be coming back on cam. But, um... I like to even do, like, for this section, I'm going to use this much. And then what I like to do is put some gel on my hand like this. Palm this. Okay. Now I'm going to section that off. I like to use a little bit of gel. Girl, this may be, this size may be a little too big, but I can't tell until I actually twist it, okay? I almost was going to do loose twists, but we're going to go ahead and do these twists. I'm going to do a little bit of gel towards the ends. <laughs> of braids i mean twists we're going for okay and this is what they're gonna look like down um and i'm gonna make sure that the ends are looking neat especially since i'm gonna be putting rubber bands towards them so hey you guys how are you guys doing and so it's been a couple of days since i set my hair in these two strand twists and now it's time for me to moisturize my hair and then tomorrow i'm going to be adding the wooden beads to my hair all right, y'all. Let's see what we got here. I've been keeping my hair in these goody stretchy bands so that I won't get any shrinkage. All right. Now I'm going to be lightly misting my hair with Alpha G Green Tea Reconstructor because I don't know. I just want to. All right. I'm going to be using the Hollywood Beauty olive oil conditioner 
rubbing that through and now I'm just going to squeeze this in my hair a little bit more okay and then we have my oil mixture with amla oil by the way excuse my baby he's laughing and a little bit more oil I'm heavy-handed towards my ends again squeezing the end you definitely don't you definitely don't need to use as much as I'm using but I have thick strands see this is what my hair looks like look at that beautiful all right so now I'm going to put my hair in pig's tails like Pippi Longstocking is coming into your okay I'm sorry okay and then towards the ends like that so and like this Going to go ahead. I can feel that wall coming down, but that's okay. Loosely so I don't get a headache, and then put my bonnet on. And that's it. And then in the morning time, I will be adding my wooden beads. Hey y'all, how you? Oh, girl, my glasses are all dirty, child. Girl, I know, I know y'all. I know y'all saying, "Why ain't you ever together?" <laughs> because <clears throat> it wouldn't be a Vivian video if I was together. All right, you guys. I am now working on the second week. Who is this? Second week of me having my hair in these twists, and I haven't put not in not now one bead. So I went ahead and I put together the beads. I even further drilled holes, holes in these beads if I needed to. So I have my wooden beads that I told you guys about. And then I have my rubber bands and I have my gold accessories. Now I need to watch the time because I need to be out of here in 30 minutes. So, I'm gonna do six in this front one here. Or maybe five, I'll do five, child. Let me try to... And I like the wooden beads because they don't look so childlike. Like the other beads of all, even though they're pretty, those are the beads that the kids wear. I ain't no kid, even though I act like it sometimes. All right, is that five? That's five, all right. Put that twist through. Ooh. Ooh. Those are not, I'm not gonna force it. Those are, are giving me some problems. I just put it on again last night so that's the first one ain't that cute let's continue all right you guys so i'm going to go ahead like i stated and add the beads to my hair i ended up not using as many beads as i thought i was kind of struggling here even though i ended up drilling some holes or at least making the holes bigger with my mini drill still struggling because these twists are just a smidge bigger than how i typically set them but that's okay I, even though I said I was going to wear these for another two weeks, I think I'm going to take this down after the week and a half because I am going to be going to Houston here and I want my hair down and out and in a very beautiful state. Um, I found that with my hair, when I allow my hair to set longer, even with the humidity, I can have a twist that lasts a couple of days. So I'm just going to go ahead and continue adding the beads and the hair accessories.
All right, you guys, I am done putting in the beads and this is what they look like. A little less than what I normally would do, but this is all I did. I didn't want to be like uh, too much. So my hair still looks really good. Look at the shine, baby. Look at that. Yeah. So that is it, you guys. I will probably keep these in for another two weeks. And when I unravel, it's going to be a banging, banging twist. Now, look at those nails, girl. Y'all know my favorite color is purple because it's royalty. And I feel royal. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. And thank you, as always, to all of my new subscribers. Take care. Bye.